This was a 3D printed SLA, and from the SLA we went to a urethane casting. So we did about half a dozen of these that they got approval from their clients. And the urethane casting, now we can start to introduce different materials, different colors, then the 3D printing, and then the final product in production. Hi, I'm Bob Pedros from Veloce Engineering in Oxford, Connecticut. We provide product design and rapid prototyping, 3D printing, urethane casting. One of our strongest selling features is that we're a product design and rapid prototyping company and we really understand the client's needs. Here's the finished product of how we help the client go from concept through to production. They needed a, a product that was going to hold their curling iron. So they came to us for some conceptual work to see how we can design a product that would do that for them. So when in the open state, this product is made of silicone and it would hold a hot curling iron without burning. And then when they want to stow it away, you can stow it away hot. It's got a cord keeper and you put it away. We did all the sketching and different ideation that we did for them. We brought it into CAD, into SolidWorks, did all the CAD design, and then we did the prototyping. So on the prototyping side of the business, we 3D print the part, like the SLA part, and from that SLA part, we create a silicone mold. In that silicone mold, we fill with a urethane. So now you can start to get more options in the 3D printing. You can start to add pigments. You can start to get very flexible parts. So we were able to do a few different concepts for them and give them that confidence uh, before he went to production tooling. Now the product is in production, and they're making two to 300,000 of these a year. Uh, the whole process took ab about 30 to 60 days. Yeah, and that's the, it's in the name there, right? Veloce, so the, Veloce just means rapid in Italian, so it's like rapid engineering is what we do, and, and clients can kind of rely on us for turning these uh, designs around very quickly. So all the products we design, uh, all the CAD files, we, we provide to their production partners so they can move forward with whatever production tooling they require. So we're not only providing the service, we're providing that peace of mind that the drawings are correct. So we do a lot of work with consumer product uh, manufacturers, and whether they do the design or we do the design, we create the prototypes that look like the final product. So we'll create labeling for this, we'll put caps on them, they'll put product in it, make it look like the real product. Then they get it in front of their branding group and in front of their marketing group, they get approval before they go to production with the final product. We do a lot on the medical device side as well. We design the mechanism for the articulation on this medical device. The clients will come to us for the mechanical design on it. Uh, we'll do all the documentation required, all the analysis required, tolerance analysis. So all the engineering efforts that go into uh, a medical device. I worked for U.S. Surgical and Covidian for 11 years, so I have a strong medical device background. So it's always been a nice, a great fit for us because I know what to provide them that's going to make their job a lot easier. This is a client uh, who came to us and needed a new design for a screwdriver. They, they provide the shaft for us and then we do a urethane casting for the rigid yellow and red pieces and as well as the soft touch on here. And that's done through the urethane casting process where we create a silicone mold from the 3D printed part. We insert the metal shaft, the substrate, into the mold and then we urethane cast the material over the metal part. We have a process for providing medical grade rapid prototypes off of the SLA and the, we have surgeons who are using the product in the operating room. See us and other quality suppliers at d2p.com.